Apple releases iOS 15.1 beta update. Here's everything new coming to iPhones. Just a day after releasing the iOS 15 and iPad OS 15 updates, Apple has already seeded the first betas of iOS 15.1 and iPad OS 15.1. The new updates reintroduce features like SharePlay, and below, we have a list of what's new. Available in FaceTime, SharePlay is designed to let users call up their friends and family and then watch TV and listen to music together using neat features. Like shared playlists and TV shows syncing for all users. SharePlay also allows for screen sharing. If testing goes well, SharePlay could see an official launch in iOS 15.1. Announce Calls In the settings for the phone app, there's a new icon for the Announce Calls setting. Lossless Audio for HomePod The HomePod 15.1 beta that accompanies the iOS 15.1 beta adds lossless audio and Dolby Atmos with spatial audio support to the HomePod and HomePod Mini. Vaccine Cards in Wallet The iOS 15.1 beta that was introduced today allows iPhone users to upload their COVID-19 vaccination status to the Health app and then generate a vaccination card in Apple Wallet. In iOS 15, verifiable health records can be downloaded and stored in the Health app, and this includes COVID-19 vaccination records and health results. In iOS 15.1, vaccination records are able to be added to the Wallet app so a vaccine card can be provided to businesses, restaurants, venues, and more where vaccines are required for entry. The Apple Wallet vaccination card can be shown to businesses, venues, restaurants, and more that are requiring vaccines for entry. As outlined in an announcement to developers, verifiable health records are based on the Smart Health Card specification. California is using Smart Health Cards, so users in California can add their vaccination records to the Wallet app after installing iOS 15.1. Other states and health organizations that use the Smart Health Cards will be able to use a button to let users know that they can download and store their vaccination information in the Health app and in the Wallet app. California, Louisiana, New York, Virginia, Hawaii, and some Maryland counties support Smart Health Cards, Sam's Club, and CVS Health. So those in the specific supported states should be able to look up their information in state databases, but those who were vaccinated through companies like Walmart and CVS will also be able to add their information to the health and wallet apps because it's the same system. Some apps like the one used by the NHS in the UK allowed users to add their vaccination records to the wallet app, but the new solution is a universal standard that will work for all healthcare states that implement it.